easy way to say this. I found exactly what I was looking for on Perdan. Full-blown infestation. Everyone is dead. And soon, that number is going to include me. I got careless and infected. It's in your hands now. I want you to know that I never gave up. Never stopped fighting, even after those things. Not once did I bow my head. By the time you hear that, I will have carved my name on the surface of this planet with a smoking crater. Zula Hendrix, signing off. Welcome, welcome, my friends. Alien Rogue Incursion, a VR game coming to Steam and to uh, MetaQuest, etc. So, in, in the Alien Universe, a VR game. So, guys, I'm thrilled and I like it. And it's by Survios. So, 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 Survios is the name. So, they gave us the raw data. Greed, Rise to Glory was okay. Uh, raw data was, was really good. The Walking Dead onslaught was not such a big success, but. I have to say, I really, really liked uh, Raw Data when it came out. So those guys, they made the whole development when it comes to VR game. So pretty cool. Coming at 19th of December. So this is going to be a little Christmas present for myself because I plan actually to get this day one exactly for the price of like uh, under 30 euros. So in eight weeks, so I have to turn this off. So pretty cool. Why uh why a deluxe edition, deluxe edition standard game, blue camo armor, blue camo weapon, and more to come. Hmm, difficult to say. I mean that's a price difference of 20 euros. So I guess I'm going to be fine with the standard version of the game, guys. So but I look forward to it. And uh, what are people uh, thinking at the moment about this game? So let's find out. Oh, so mixed gameplay feedback. There's a consensus that while the game captures the tense and terrifying atmosphere of the Alien franchise, the gameplay has received mixed reviews. Some users find the gameplay mechanics like manual reloading and the intelligent behavior of xenomorphs to add to the horror experience, making it immersive and challenging. However, others criticize it for being boring or overly punishing, with situations where players feel there's no chance to escape or fight back once detected. So guys, this is all from people that played this game already. This is what people think about this game. So game is obviously not out yet. So this might change. Get graphics and sound design. The game has been praised for its graphical fidelity and sound design, which contribute significantly to the tense and immersive experience. The environments coupled with the audio are set to make for a very atmospheric VR experience. Then we have story and characters, the narrative and character development, especially the protagonist uh, Zula Hendrix have been highlighted positively in some feedback suggests suggesting in an engaging story that fits well within the alien universe we are experience so alien universe always a female uh, main characters as you know the VR experience. There's an appreciation for how the game utilizes VR to enhance the horror experience. The feeling of being in the alien universe with xenomorphs that can attack from any direction is both terrifying and thrilling for players. However, this also means the game demands a lot from its players in terms of both hardware, high-end VR setups, you need to have a good PC, my friends, and emotional resilience due to the intense nature. <laughs> To be honest, some horror games are in VR really, really, really scary. So criticism on repetitiveness and innovation and take this with a grain of salt since the game is not out yet. Some players feel that while the game looks great and has good mechanics, it could have pushed for more innovation rather than sticking closely to the known formulas. There's a sentiment that it might not stand out enough on its own merits outside the Alien franchise shadow. And then we have, yeah, boy, I mean, we want an Alien game, so I'm fine with that performance issues mention has been made of performance issues indicating that the game might re Require high-end hardware to run smoothly, which could be a barrier for some players, not for me. Ha ha ha! Over reception uh, seems to be well received by fans of the franchise and VR enthusiasts looking for deep immersive horror experience. However, it also faces criticism for not fully satisfying those looking for new gameplay mechanics or those who find the survival horror elements too oppressive or repetitive. 
So Alien Rogue Incursion delivers a faithful terrifying alien experience in VR, though it might not universally appeal to all gamers due to the, its specific focus on horror and survival elements. Yeah, well, the VR setting, obviously, my friend. So I like aliens. I like VR. I like to have a dedicated alien games in the in VR world. So for me, it's a I purchase this game. I buy this game. So it it must have really bad. Uh, if if the critics are like under sixty percent, then. And probably I think about it, but hey, guys, I want to have this game. So I'm I'm pushed. I'm pushed for to get this game. So well done. Give this game to me now. I want it now. Give it me now. Now, 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 now. Okay. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.